This short video is on the relationship between meditation and creativity and particularly the topic of how activity and receptivity are essential faculties or qualities in the creative process. Now in meditation you can become very vividly aware of these two primary ways of being. The way that you take things in, notice them, which is the receptivity. The way that you listen, uh, and the way that you absorb things. How you pay attention, uh, whether it's taking in a very narrow sphere of ideas or activities, or whether it's taking in both detail and a bigger picture. So receptivity being open to experience, open to what is happening, is an important part of creativity. And it also happens to be one of the primary qualities that is developed in the context of meditation. The other counterpart is the active, the initiative, uh, the decision to do something. And it might seem that the two qualities of being receptive and open and noticing and deciding being active are in some way uh, different, but actually they're both integrated in awareness. They need to come together. And one of the main ways that the active aspect of awareness and engagement comes into experience is clear sense of purpose and intentionality of what you're doing. Now that can be very general. You know, you can be just saying, I'm going to uh, be paying attention to this piece of clay or this piece of embroidery or this piece of writing or music or painting. That is my general intention. I'm going to stay with this. I'm going to stay with and engaged with this. So in that, that intention is something that you do. It's quite clearly intentionality and active aspect of the mind. But in that intentionality, you notice things. And the way that you're active and the way that you're creative is a combination of the intentionality to stay with this project and also the noticing of how things change while you engage with it. And the receptivity, receptivity allows you to notice things and to respond. So you notice and respond, you're receptive and you're active. And these two facets are relating to each other all the time. Something inspires you or something takes your fancy or something triggers your imagination and you act, you develop it. And so this relationship between receptivity and activity is an essential part of just coming into awareness and the sense of presence in meditation. Thank you.